So a few months ago, I tried the Snapchat AI, but all it was, it was a Q&A. However, Photoshop currently has this new tool which helps you generate stuff with AI. For example, as you can see now, or now, or now, nothing in my surroundings is real. It's generated by an AI, and that's what we're gonna do today. So here we are in Photoshop. The first image I chose to expand with this software was this picture right here, and this is what it generated. None of this is real. Neither is this, or this, or this. I think this is a very cool result, I'd say. I also took this picture and this is what it made like who is this then I took this picture of me like on a bike and that is really weird cool and creepy at the same time then there was this and it made this it knew I was on a bike then there was this one and it thought I was on a scooter instead I then took this still from one of my videos and it made this what this one into this like none of this is real I think you can tell this is a real door and this is a fake door then I took this picture of my friend and this is what it made <laughs> my favorite thing is this cat right here like on the microphone that is so cool now let's try together so I want the software to generate what's missing in the picture let's start with this picture I just want to see like a whole cat that's the plan here select this inverse and generate then now it's gonna take 10 seconds this is how quick it takes Oh my god, you see? That is amazing. Let's try this picture here. What are we gonna get? Wow, that's very realistic. I like this one. I'm wondering if it uses also internet knowledge, not just from this picture, because this is the Big Ben. It might know what I want to generate. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> oh wow, that looks nice. Now, let's see if it can do a person. Whoa, this is the most realistic one. Wow, look at these two. This is impressive. Let's see this one. I'm in a forest, so it should be easy. Nice. It's so weird, just clicking through these, knowing nothing else is real. If you saw this you wouldn't realize and that's very scary i took this selfie years ago i'm quite curious to what it thinks it can make oh wow i feel like it thinks i'm in a fish tank that is technically right i had a fish eye lens on the phone and it's technically right because it should look like this oh my god who is this we get cool results but also very creepy now i could go all day expanding all the pictures i want but we can do lots more with this tool now this picture here i look very young let's try to make myself look like how i am now Okay, I tried my best and this is what it came up with. What? I think there's a lot room for improvement with this thing, but not bad, right? We look the same. Now here, I really want to test you at home. So we're going with this picture here. Which one is real? Number one, number two, number three, number four, or number five. Drum roll, please. It's number two. This is a real picture. If you guessed it right, let me know. This is one of the other ones that it generated. This looks like I'm modeling and there's someone watching me. This thing they just added is so cool. And I just have so much fun playing playing with it like here it generated my hat and also some random paintings it's just the fact that I can do this in seconds like I want the selfie to be bigger boom I wait a couple of seconds I can walk around the room and it's done and what the hell this is so real that is insane look this is me in the video and this is what it made from that to this this is scary what are you gonna do with this picture yes there's not a pocket in the hoodie but this is cool these are so cool here's some pictures that took in Spain and I think we're gonna get some good ones here it's definitely gonna know it's in the sea Oh my god. Palm tree? Okay. This one's great. I'm underwater. It thinks I'm in a swimming pool, I guess. Maybe we should tell this software that we're in the sea. Let's give it some help. Beach. That's quite cool. If it wasn't for these lines here, but that's quite cool. If only there was a way of getting rid of the lines. Oh look, it's that simple. This is what people are so worried about because this would normally take a few minutes for an actual person to do, but it took 10 seconds for this software. That's the scary part. There we go. It understood a lot better when it's explained. Wow, that's good. This is from last week. <laughs> it thinks I'm in a kitchen. Oh, because I'm holding orange and pear. Hey guys, I got a tattoo. Look at that. It thinks I'm in a kitchen because I'm holding this. That's very weird. Now we've done those. However, as I said at the beginning, I made another video on AI a few months ago, and this is what I created. An AI version of me. Let's see if it can generate an already generated image. Oh my god. Who are these people that keep appearing? This is so weird. Look, this is better. It's made me musclier. <laughs> Thank you. Let's see who this guy is. Let's face reveal this guy. Let's just expand this like this and generate the rest. I think this is the creepiest thing I've done. Oh my god. <laughs> That's weird. It's kind of how I would imagine the person to look like. When I filmed the things I hate video like last month, I stood up and it looked like this. And I like this still for some reason. Let's see my new appearance according to AI. <laughs>
<laughs> what the hell? Whoa. No, 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 no. I want to end the video right now. I don't like that. No, I don't like that. Okay, this is better. It's got my hair, part of my beard, but this is how I look like, just to remind you. <laughs> and finally, one thing this AI can do is connect two pictures together. What if there was a way for my present self to connect to my past self? Here's me from 2012. Here's me from 2023. I am really curious. This I have not tried, so I don't know what it's gonna make. I'm gonna be as surprised as you. And for the last time today, let's generate. I'm gonna stand up for this. Let's see what it makes. Oh my god, that's creepy. But I love it. Oh, uh, it's me and me <laughs> in the same room. I really like this picture. It's two me's doing what they love. YouTube, <laughs> subscribe.